to provide for an additional temporary extension of programs under the Small Business Act and the Small Business Investment Act of 1958 and for other purposes. This may be part of something that's, that was just written up in Wired. I sent you a link. You yeah, no, I, I, I was about to say that. So this is what Udall is about, that there's actually a secret Patriot Act that we haven't seen yet. Yeah, and apparently Senator Ron Wyden is uh, from Oregon, is a Democrat from Oregon, has been kind of hinting about it. <laughs> and and he's on the Intelligence Committee, but he can't say what it is because it's all classified. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge, say no more. And I'll just read a little piece from this article. So one component of the Patriot Act in particular gives them immense pause is the so-called business records provision, which empowers the FBI to get businesses, medical offices, banks, and other organizations to turn over any tangible things <laughs> it deems relevant to any security investigation. You got a problem with that? I always thought they were doing this already. <laughs> Anyway, basically, they can go after all records. They can tap your phone. They can do all kinds of stuff. There's a bunch of extra stuff. This article is quite interesting because there's like it's like everything you think is bad about the Patriot Act just make it worse. <laughs> and I think that they're just basically just recording everything they can on these you know terabyte drives on everybody they can. Oh yeah, it's got it's gotten even. But I mean, it, at first it sounds good because all about terror. Oh, we're going to oh, be able terrorism. to track some guy down. Oh. But once they get this these systems in place, it's going to be about normal crime. You say, well, I don't know, is this guy a jaywalker? I don't know, let's check him out. Let's follow his... <laughs> Look well, at yeah. that. There's a uh, hundred bucks we can collect. Uh, yeah, kick that guy's ass. Car rent, literally, Todd Hinnon, who represents the type of material collected thus far as more individualistic and specific, specific drivers, license records, hotel records, car <laughs> rental records, apartment <laughs> leasing records, credit card records. Hooker records. Blow well, records. that's the idea. You get somebody, you can, now you can create blackmailing schemes. You can find out what stocks to get into. This is one of the problems with this loss of privacy. Now the government, some agents within the government who are exploiting this information can figure out there's a merger acquisition going on. They can get in on it. it no one's ever going to be able to trace anything. I mean, the whole thing. Or you can blackmail somebody in Congress and get them to vote a certain way for, you know, genomic engineering or whatever. The whole thing, this is why it's bad. It's not because you're doing something bad. I keep, oh, I'm not doing anything bad. I don't care. You should care because somebody who might be doing something sketchy, you know, like maybe thinking about divorcing their wives. Oh, no. <laughs> you know, and then the next thing you know, they the, somebody finds out about, it and then it, then blackmails them so they vote a certain way, and that way they vote hurts you, the members of the public. That's the problem. If you see something, say something.